Silly student, play more Nova Drift. And I don't know quite what I want to do today. Other than be very aggressive, apparently, here in our opening. Like, yeah, I don't care if you hit me. I just want your sweet, sweet experience points. Haven't used Salvo a lot lately. Just go good old Reflex Shield. Lots of possibilities here. Engineer for wingman. Body. Could provide better area coverage. Architect. You know, I usually go engineer, wingman, and all that. Maybe we should just try Architect. Let's try Architect. That's something a little bit unusual for me. A little bit different. My main issue will be the shield. If I go Apex Machinery, give up my shield to the Construct to get there, that's going to be problematic. Do I want Barrage? Or do I want Charge Shot? Which direction am I going? I think I do not want Barrage. I think I want to go Charge Shot instead. If I go wingman, I will not need the evasion. I do want to get warp strike, so I need to move down towards blink. But I also need snipe for that as well. We'll get the Velocity first. There's the Nanotech Reconstruction. This is probably going to be less than ideal because it depends on me being a decent pilot compared to just having the interceptor running around on its own. But maybe we can make it work. We shall see. I know it's my fault, <clears throat> excuse me, for not giving you evasion, but you really shouldn't stand quite so close to the enemy. I do want to go down the priority zero tree, so...
sure we'll keep on doing this. Overclock is perfectly acceptable. And we are finally starting to work our way through their outer orbitals here. And thank you, Comet. Probably should focus on this little turret down there. But there's so much else going on. Their support specialist. 2% less hull and shield, but faster assembly speed and construct rate of fire. I do want that rate of fire increase. I think I'll take the orbs of discord here, yes. Do I want warpath? With Salvo, warpath is pretty much always going to be useful. Just helps increase your missile construct rate. Briefly, but that still counts. Alright, Station Omega. I'm rather annoyed at missing that lovely little convoy over there, but I didn't want to risk leaving this area. Alright, now we just need to do damage to the enemy. Get the interceptor going. Happy to see that. Very happy to see that. There's the wingman. All right, let's have fun. Going to try to get a few of these experience crystal things and Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully it'll work out. I do want overpower. Question is, do we want something like siege weaponry? Let's start with what we know we want for certain. Not horribly impressed by the rate of fire even then. Hmm. Let's see if charge shot makes it any better. Also not happy to see yet another singularity here. Neither of those are useful. Calibrate could be. We'll take a calibrate. Traffic's busy on the road today, he gets. I do try to dampen the sound a bit, but it is not always as effective as I wish it was. Do I want a revelation? Sure, why not? I don't know if I would need an incendiary strike. How much damage are we hitting? Eh, 
It's a decent amount. It's not incredible, though. Still, it could help. Don't mind me. Mm -hmm. I could get heavy caliber times three. All right, there's Snipe. Now we just need to move down towards Blink and we can get Warp Strike. Mastery is nice. Let's save enemy if you want to pop on down for a visit. We'll be happy to have you. So what do we want now? I guess we want to move towards Apex Machinery and we also want Warp Strike. Lots of other little things would be nice as well, but... Hmm, Tactical Link is nice as well though. But we'll get the improved thrusters. Focus on the things we want most. Not horribly impressed by these choices, but Charge Shot could be interesting. Increased damage, velocity, projectile size, and blast radius. We'll give it a go. Yeah, those are some rather large missiles. more good for hopefully dying very quickly yeah that's pretty good I approve hmm. 
a little early for the quantum decoherence. A little more masochism wouldn't hurt. I don't do much self damage, but. Tarek's taking more damage could be helpful. Let's reload, though. Reload, reroll. Tactical Link? Sure. Deadly Wake. There's the Blink. And there's the Warp Strike. Oops, and there's also a Delivery. We shall see. Be back in a bit. And we return to pick Warp Strike. That should help a great deal. As usual, we do now have to worry about screen wrapping ourselves. That will hurt us. So we should try to avoid it. Not too shabby. Now this should not put out as much damage as say an engineer with three wingman would. But my hope is it will be a tad more survivable. <sighs> no hidden power please. Tarding could be nice, but I think I just want the blast radius really. And the high explosive. Rupture could be very useful for crowd control if nothing else. And a little extra damage is a little extra damage. Now I still have not really made any progress in the elegant construction tree. So that may be something we need to prioritize. I'm going to give up my shield, I'm fairly certain. So I'll just take the concentrated blast then. Yeah, I can't say we don't do decent damage nonetheless. Whatever other problems we might have. I do want rupture, but I really need this elegant construction. Helps our assembly speed, gives our constructs more whole, all that good stuff. All right, Seraph. Almost one entire salvo. Is it the moment of truth? Do we get shielded constructs? Apex will give us a lot more rate of fire but it will also make us more vulnerable. Give it a go is all I can say. Give it a go. I know Ifco Z did a really wonderful run if you're interested in... I think it was using... Mines? Yes, yeah, Salvo Mines. I think that came out a couple days ago. If you really want to see how powerful a well set up salvo can be, I would recommend checking it out. It can be pretty crazy. Yep, 
Yeah, that was my concern about giving up our shield. Hmm. I'm gonna have to try that again with more. Maybe just don't give up our shield. More survivability or something. Still, I did enjoy that one. Definitely something I want to play around more with. Maybe don't even take the blast damage. Hmm. There's lots of possibilities there. We'll have to experiment. In any event, as always, thank you for coming by.